Okay, so this portion of the review is going to be showing the different pieces of equipment uh, attached to the front of the H series. So, first up, I'm just going to do a quick overview of the snowblower, show you guys how it works. Uh, snowblower function, uh, the blades uh, spin and they spin smoothly. They are made out of die cast and uh, they look to be very good quality. I don't know if you can see it in there, but there is. I'll try to get this so that it works. Inside, behind the set of yellow blades, see right there, there's that black blade. And that's powered by the drive shaft that comes in. That if I spin it on the back side with my uh, fingers, that does spin as well. It doesn't spin, but it, it is functional. So then, moving to the back side, just got some safety chains, uh, some roller wheels there, uh, hydraulic hoses. This angles up and down. Uh, the way that this attaches is uh, very simple. You just take the hooks. You got first. You got to pull this pin out. Sit snug. Pull that pin out. Put that over. Line it up. Just gotta get it lined up. I know it's a good thing I'm not trying to do a promotional for this, otherwise this would not be good. Some bitch. Sometimes it helps if you go in one side, not the other, for whatever reason. So we'll give it a shot on this side. There we go, just wasn't up high enough. Alright, so then you get that pin in, and you're good to go with the snowblower, so you just you need to run it off those hydraulics for lifting and whatnot. So, and that's that. So, pull that pin out. The next one's the plow. So plows, uh, typical TWH plow, uh, the way it works, same thing, that drops over and you run the pins through, it's got chains and uh, a hydraulic cylinder to lift it, uh, the hydraulic cylinder isn't stiff enough to hold it up, um, but I can fix that, no problem, and it does angle, so pretty basic. You get it on the model for you now. I think this is my favorite. The plow. So, if, as if I uh, see uh, pulling up on the cylinder, as if uh, that cylinder did work, that would be as high as up it go as it goes, which is pretty good. And then if it's angled, that's its full angle capacity to one side full angle capacity to the other and then, once again I just really like the looks of it with the plow on it just you know in my opinion looks pretty good also these wheels do go up and down so you just spin them around face the right direction and push them down onto the floor or the ground rather so pull that out and then uh, the way it works for the sweepers you've got this bracket piece which if you watch the unboxing I dropped uh, which you take this and this goes on here and run the pin through it and then the way the sweeper hooks on which I'm not a very big fan of I'd rather have it work with the regular bracket system but uh, it does uh, this bracket does enable you to if you make your own attachments all you have to do is put a little clip on it like that and it just drops in right there like this 
basically you just make sure these are that's up all the way that's down and it just clips on like that like I said I'm not a huge fan of that but um, you know it does enable you to do other things with it so I'm gonna show you the sweeper the sweeper is very wide uh, it does have some functionality to it uh, there are two hydraulic cylinders which uh, you would not want to pop out the cylinders on so, so that, we'll just watch out for that when you get this model. That was stupid. That's it. So that's your functionality of those right there. And then uh, this end does open up to show some uh, wiring going down to the blade itself. Same thing with the other end, opens up. So this top piece comes off, this top covering. Uh, to show some wiring going along here this says uh, sweepster snow eliminator and this is sweepster over here it does show some uh, warning labels and whatnot going along the top here also there are four tracking wheels that would go along with this so just drop that back on just like that and there are there is a uh, lift cylinder which uh, Lifts if you hold this in the same place, it pivots it uh, over the rolling wheels that always stay on the ground, and then it does swivel as well. Swivels pretty far one way or the other. But uh, I'm gonna get it on the model for you. So if you were to swivel it up, it'd be up off like that, and then back down. So. And then uh, to one side, and then to the other. I also like the look of the sweeper just because it's different, and uh, this sweeper doesn't come with the model. It's an, it was an extra, you know, 27 bucks. But so, like I was saying, just gotta take the, uh, you got all these hydraulic hoses, and uh, they just fit into the fittings underneath there. So, um, this was a review of the Oshkosh H, H series snow removal uh, apparatus, vehicle, whatever you want to call it, with the snow blower, sweeper, and plow. Uh, this was made by TWH in 150 scale. Um, really good, nice model, highly recommend it. Uh, for the price, it's actually really reasonable. So, thanks a lot for watching, guys, and have a good one.